Hello YouTube, what's going on? My name is Condor, and this is the first video that I have um, that includes commentary. Uh, it's Hardcore Team Deathmatch in Skid Row, and I hope you enjoy it. Um, the class that I'm going to choose is my Mini Uzi class. The Death perks match. that I'm going to be using are uh, Marathon Pro, Stopping Power Pro, and... Ninja Pro. Sorry about the gap there. Um, just got uh, got an eight to five job uh, that has the tech support for Meyer stores. So, brain's a little scrambled at the moment. Um, well, let me introduce myself. Uh, besides my job, I'm 25 years old. I live in Grand Rapids, Michigan. Uh, born and raised in Flint, Michigan. And. You know, um, in my spare time I play video games. I've been playing Modern Warfare 2 a lot. Um, it's, been, it's been a lot of fun. Um, the, the gun that I'm using right now, the Mini Uzi, uh, has the silencer attached to it. I really like it. Um, as you can probably see, uh, I'm more of a run and gun kind of guy. Um, it's just the type of style that I do. Um, now, we're on Skid Row. I don't really like this part of the map. You see this? Um, that tunnel, if you rush down the tunnel, and that's kind of a drawback, if you rush down the tunnel, you'll probably get shot in the face by somebody who's hiding in that little cubby hole up there. Uh, the enemy team loves to hang out up there, um, unless some of your guys happen to get there first. So, that's one of the drawbacks of being a running gunner. Another drawback that you will see here uh, before this video is done is the fact that you will easily run into claymores and enemy explosives. And that's not cool either. Um, unless you happen to have the Scrambler Pro perk, which will uh, uh, delay the trip by about three seconds or so, giving you enough time to get out of the way. If you have Marathon and Lightweight with a submachine gun, though, you might be able to get away because you're running faster. But... I don't know about that. So, uh, so yeah. Another thing, that, another important thing about this map is, it, especially in a capture the flag game, if you're gonna snipe, take the enemy flag from this part of the map, you're gonna want to make sure that you have a group of guys covering that building because that is a sniper's nest. You gotta, you get one good sniper in that room. And maybe a couple of other supporting guys, including some claymores. You're the, you're gonna have that flag pretty secure. So going for it's gonna be especially tough. Um, another uh, the game types that I usually play are uh, team deathmatch, um, especially mer mercenary team deathmatch. If I happen to be playing alone, because I don't want to get stuck alone with some big clan that wants to stop my face in. Um. I occasionally play Capture the Flag. Um, I like Domination a lot, too. Um, mostly, though, I'm playing Team Deathmatch. And, um... What's more is I'm also part of a clan. Uh, the official name of the clan is the Solo Deus. Um, I am a lev I am a rank 6 Neophyte. Which is, um, I'm like an ordinary clan member, but rank 6, because I posted 100 posts in their forum. I'm not sure many of you are going to care about that, just a little tidbit. But, um, some of my earlier videos, I've dubbed the De Solo Deus Chronicles. Basically chronicles, uh, some of my matches with fellow teammates. And, uh, obviously this is not going to be a part of that because it, it doesn't showcase any of my clan mates. Um, I actually plan on having one of my series become Catch the Condor. Um, I guess let me let me know what you guys think of that. This 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 video is really more like a test to uh, see how my uh, recording sound is. I just picked up a wire. I just picked up a USB microphone. Funny story. Um, I have a PS3. Recently, I acquired from my local GameStop a copy of Metal Gear Solid 2 Sons of Liberty and Metal Gear Solid 3 Subsistence. And I was pretty stoked and looking forward to playing those games, but uh, unfortunately, what happened was I got a PS3 Slim on New Year's Eve. So, 
they aren't uh, backwards compatible with PS2 games, which really sucks. So instead, I got uh, a copy of Resident Evil Umbrella Chronicles and this USB Logitech mic, which has um, Disney Interactive on the front. Oh, joy. I'll probably have to put some black masking tape over that, because... When I think of Disney nowadays, all I can think of is, like, the corporate horror uh, mentality thing. Well, let's uh, get away from that. Check this out. Uh, I actually get off a pretty good kill streak here. Um, I don't quite remember what all three of my kill streaks were. I just popped three guys in a row, popped a fourth guy. Because there's a little cubby hole here by this uh, light pole, you know? And another thing about running around is you got to know your surroundings, otherwise you'll just run right by it. So I knife, so I get this guy. Uh, I didn't knife him, <laughs> and I break out the Predator missile. I gotta tell you, um, aerial kill streaks on Skid Row are like not very useful um, because there's so much overhead cover, and all you gotta do to avoid um, is get some overhead cover, get in a building, um, get a roof over your head, and you should be okay. Um, predator missiles, though, if you if you time them right, you can ca actually catch people halfway through that little tunnel. But um, you know, chop you know chopper gunners, harriers, and pavlos. You know, the only only use you're gonna find them with them is if everybody's outside. So I think I had a predator missile, uh, harrier, and nuke. I think I might have had a nuke equipped at this time. <laughs> Lord knows why I think I'm gonna do good enough to get a nuke. I'd have to look it over, I don't know. But, um... Yeah, this is, uh... Turning out to be quite the death fest. But, um... I end up actually going 12 and 18, so I only go negative 6. I know, that's not very impressive by, uh... Today's YouTube author standards, but... It's pretty good to me. It's a lot of fun waiting to spawn. It's, uh, especially when it takes 12 full seconds to do it. Yeah, you might as well go to the bathroom or something to take care of that. One more piece of advice about um, Skid Row is um, I think I think it's going to come up in a bit. Yeah, you just saw me run into a claymore head first. Um, <laughs> that's not the last time. You know, watch it. Watch your watch the screen, kids. Because, like I said, you know, I like running around and running and gunning. And having Marathon Pro certainly helps, because you get a limited sprint and you climb obstacles faster. But, what you don't realize is, if you run too fast and don't look around, you're going you're gonna to get thrown in the face with the Claymore. Um, I'm not going to remember that other strategy, except stay out of the open areas in front of the shop. There she is, a 7500 to 5300. My Army Rangers got beaten up pretty good. Uh, game winning kill, sick UMP silenced. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, I am out of here. Peace, 12 and 18.